This is so exciting. Hello, my name is Daphne, and I'm a professional monster girl. Being a professional monster girl, my job is to spook and scare people. John is my first assignment. He's young, so that may be kind of a challenge. But I don't think he's too young. He must be 30-something, so I think I'm gonna be okay. That's about when they start getting generally scared again. You know, do you guys think he's younger? Anyway, this is exciting. I'm thinking of starting with a classic. The bathroom mirror scare. The bathroom mirror scare is a classic. The scary thinks it's just bathroom business as usual. You know, goes to the sink, looks in the mirror, all good. Leans down to wash their face. Looks up again, bam! Me. So, today didn't go exactly as planned. Let's say that what happened was unexpected. It's okay. I have a few more tricks up my sleeve. We get to have a late start, but it's fine. Everything's gonna be okay. For sure. One of the perks of this job is that you get to stay in the house to which you've been assigned. John's apartment looks pretty decent, and getting to stay in your place of work and being able to familiarize yourself with it really makes my job easy. Tonight, I'm gonna go for the creepy shadow in the dark scare. I found the perfect spot in the living room. As soon as he turns off the light to go to sleep, ba 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 bam Me, Jean Dark. It's dark. Jean Dark? No? It's okay, tomorrow. leaves the light on when they go to sleep. I mean, of course, some people do. Babies. <sighs> I mean, it's fine, really. It's okay. There's other stuff. It's fine. 
I don't really like using props, but I need a win. We're way off schedule. Water has been used as a scare tactic a lot. Wet footprints, leaking ceilings, overflowing sinks. The victim goes to check it out and gets surprised by the monster. I don't really get it myself. It's basically a glorified water-based jump scare. And jump scares are cheap. But if you're gonna do it, go deep. This is disgusting. It better work. See on the other side. Fuck this. trouble. No, of course it doesn't count. That's disgust. We're aiming at terror. He was supposed to come and check, to lean in closer to the tub, to get fucking scared when I jump out of it. <sighs> John, tough crowd. <sighs> I think I need to take a little break from all this and do some recon. See, it is paramount to really observe your subject. Get to know its habits, its little everyday rituals. By familiarizing yourself with your subject, you can really know what makes them tick. John wakes up every morning at seven. Except on weekends. He washes his face, he brushes his teeth, and then makes a little coffee. Then he leaves for work. When he comes back, he throws his keys in his bag, takes off his jacket, opens the fridge, and takes out a beer. He always leaves it on the counter. He goes to the bathroom, washes his face, never ever looks in the mirror twice, and then goes back to open his beer. He has a little sip, and then he opens the fridge and stares at it. Sometimes he cooks, and sometimes he doesn't. And then we watch something. He, he watches something on the TV. And then he goes to sleep. 
sometimes on the bed and sometimes on the couch. Sometimes he even reads a book. Well, that's about it. Pretty much. That's what I have to work with. He sure drops things. A lot. Could it be that simple? <gasps> Could it be as simple as the monster under the bed? So, so, if I just lay here and wait for him to drop something, then I can do the scare as soon as he reaches for it and looks under the bed, right? I mean, is this hopeless? Is this ever gonna work? I mean, how? This is how it works. <laughs> you get assigned. You do the job. You're gone. <sighs> you move on to the next one. How? I mean, how? <sighs> Am I gonna stay here forever? So, I thought maybe I can revisit some of these old timers tricks and gimmicks and get some inspiration. Maybe I can come up with something new that will work. This wasn't useful at all. I mean, all of these women, first of all, the way they look, all of them. I mean, look at me. Hell, I look like an enormous plush toy. Also, look at this face. I mean, really look at it. This face is spotless. Someone could even say it's cute. Also, the children, it's, it's always the children. I mean, if your 
you're not a female child monster with a mommy problem, mind you, then you have to be a mommy monster. Like, why? I mean, why do you have to have children to be scary? <laughs> Is this even right? That's right. Fuck this. I'm my own man. W woman. I'm my own woman. I don't need to do any of the scary shit. I'm my own me. And I'm staying here. I'm staying here. And I'm liking it. This is my home now. John doesn't mind. And to be honest, I don't mind John. It's perfect. I can't believe it took me so long to decide. This, this is perfect. Oh, sh**. Mistake. My leg is gone.